Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to look at split space and how you can utilize it on your design. Let's get started. So this is the model house from our duplex house design project. Please check it out as I showed a step-by-step -step video on how it was created. This is what we're going to use for this split face. So let's go to 3D view. So the area that we're going to split face is this. So to create a split face, you need to go to modify tab and then this icon or the short keyboard shortcut SF. So once you selected split face, it will ask you to select the face that you want. So I'm going to highlight this exterior wall. So once I highlight that, it will go to the drawing mode. So I'm going to use rectangle and I'm going to orbit around. So I'm going to add this just like that. I want to make sure it's all aligned together. So AL and I'm going to get this by using tab and then aligning it. So it looks like it's aligned. Press escape. And then once you're done, click finish. So once you finish it, you'll be able to assign a different material on this. So you can go to paint. So click paint. And let's select, like for example, this parking stripe. So we could notice the difference in material. So I'm going to select this. And then after that, I'm going to close the material browser and change it to consistent color. And now as you can see, it changed the material only on the face. But if you select the wall and edit type, the structure of the wall won't be changed. So the split face is ideal for modeling, but in construction, it doesn't change the wall assembly. Thank you for watching and I hope you liked the video. Please hit like and subscribe. Feel free to comment down below.